Hello, you all. How are you guys doing? Today is Saturday. I haven't been blogging much, you all. Just haven't been in the mood for it all. But I decided to pick up the camera. I said I was going to pick up the camera a little bit today. Just to pop in, say hello. First of all, how are you doing? You. Yes, you will be on this video. I hope you're okay. I hope you're staying blessed. And I hope you just get through this trying time like the rest of us are we all in this together okay i, I y'all know one thing i like to do is get up early it's like they're saying the early bird get the get the worm the little one's still in her pajamas because i leave her here i don't have time but oh let me show y'all did i bring it in our mask finally came in i ordered some masks i will put the link probably down in the description box where i got mine but I got the disposable max. I got 50 of these. Oh, and I paid, I want to say, I'll have to look. I'll probably put it across the screen. But those came in for me. And then I also got some for Halo. And this is what these look like. Let me share these with you all. So, that's what these look like six came in a pack for her these are perfect to fit her little face and she don't like wearing them but she will be wearing the ones like this for adults so let me show y'all um i do have another order i did order like another one these are disposable too but that's what they look like y'all can see See, it has little mushrooms on it. And y'all can see that it has like cute little mushrooms on it for little kids. Perfect. It still can fit even my face, but perfect for a little kid's face. Yep. Perfect. So I got those for her. I like it. Um, they are disposable, but hey, we'll use them until we can't use them more. And I'll, I'll put the price on the screen of how much I paid for hers as well. I can't remember, but it's uh cheaper than anywhere else honey so it just took a long time for me to get it but for whatever reason like my other masks that i got that are not disposable they just sitting in california and i don't understand why these were sitting in california those are sitting in california and it's like why why are you guys doing that but anyway i got my some masks from her and i so i'm happy about that i did go out i went to lowe's I'm still working on some stuff. Plus, y'all, you have to get out early in the morning um, to check your stores to see what you can get. And it's just like, it's like you gambling at this situation. So I looked up today and I got this big old bottle of Lysol. So I, I can't be happier. I got me some Lysol wipes the other day. I still want spray, but if I can't find no spray, I'm just gonna put this like in a bottle, mix it with some water, and that's gonna be my Lysol spray and disinfect everything but um yeah so i got this big old bottle from um lowe's <laughs> uh what else did i pick up from lowe's oh just some more stuff to uh finish painting and clorox because you could just never have like this is what i'm spending my money on y'all every little dollar i get that's what I'm spending my money on. I don't have no money because I'm always buying cleaning products and just cleaning my house. And then I also got just some Pledge multi-surface cleaner because my house is getting dusty for whatever reason. So I just want to clean it down and some hooks to hang stuff up on. So that was it. And then of course I went over to Walmart and got a few groceries. I need to put this up now. Got Halo these uh, Gogurt screes. Gogurts. Now, I've been giving them to her because it's getting hot. We are in triple digits today. What? Okay, I gotta put them in the freezer. You want one now? Stop acting like a brat. 
Um, yeah, I'm gonna put them in the freezer because we are in triple digits now and it's just so hot. It's starting to heat up. So this is like a little perfect little sweet treat and to keep her cool. So that's what I'm gonna do with that. Wherever I can find some room, okay? <laughs> I ain't never able to find no room in there. I also, you like it? I also picked up these for me. The Outshine, no sugar, the fruit. Y'all yeah, have seen these before, I'm pretty sure. I love the uh, pineapple ones. They didn't have none of that. They only had like strawberry, a lime, and some other one. But I got these. Okay. I got two. I'm gonna eat that. I picked up me some. I'm just showing y'all as I go. Some minced onion, because I love cooking with minced onion, and some parsley flakes. You can never have enough parsley flakes. They didn't have none at the um last time at walmart when i went so i seen them i got them because those go by fast and the first will be here what next week so that ain't gonna be on the shelf okay and then i wanted to try anybody try the sea pack shrimp seafood uh shrimp and spring rolls i'm gonna get us a try today maybe for us to I'm eat not eating that. you're not eating it that's fine um so yeah i mean i can make them myself I never made them before and I plan on probably making some spring rolls, but I'm going to give this a try first because I don't want to be trying to do too much cooking and nothing. And then, of course, I got the little ones. This is her pancake, so I had to get some more of those because her and Luxury eat these. So I got that. You know, that's y'all know that saying, don't go to the stores when you hungry. It is so true that you just start picking up everything. Never tried these before, either these farm rich mozzarella breadsticks. I was gonna make these when I made uh, my fried zucchini, but I didn't wanna do too much. So I knew I still kinda had a taste for these, so I picked this up. I don't know, if, I never tried this before. If y'all tried it, definitely let me know. Um, but probably, probably, probably by the time y'all tell me, I've been untried it already. Picked up some vegetable broth. I wanna start cooking a little bit more with vegetable broth as well different meals finally they found me some brown eggs like i only like brown eggs i don't care for uh white eggs at all <laughs> um brown red eggs are just more richer in taste so i got that for a dinner i wanted something different i got chicken and fish in there but i don't want it um so i got some carne <sighs> I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. Maybe make some tacos. I just make some rice, oh, bell pepper, throw it together and call it a day. That's probably what I it might end up doing with this. So I got that. That was all that I picked up at Walmart. You all, um, I just been trying to stay sane. I wanted to show y'all what I did do. I had y'all sitting up there, but I put one of the shelves here it turned out really nice i like how y'all can't see it with all this junk up here but y'all can get the gist of it right let me see there brighten it up because it's kind of dark but yes i end up taking one of the shelves down put it on the window i also i need to secure my little window panes there i put that up yesterday so that's what your girl has been doing. Something new, something different. This is just not decorated. I just got this out of the garage this morning and I threw it up there and I need to clean it. But I might, I think I'm going to keep it up there and I might paint it. Not quite sure. We'll see. And then y'all know that's just stuff already I had. So, but, and y'all was sitting up on this here. So that's why that was like that. But anywho, so working on my pantry. I kind of finished uh, the wall. I still got it. Get a few more touches at the ceiling there. This is my next project. It's pulling all of these out. I need to clean it. So that's what I did. Because it's dirty. It is really dirty. Never cleaned it before. But this is the next project I'm going to be working on. So I'm going to uh, probably share with y'all what I'll be doing with that. Um, 
what I want to do with that. I want to put some um, shells in there. I want to take those wire shells out of there because it just takes up so much space. I mean, when they decide to put those in houses, like, I don't know what they was thinking of because it's just the little brackets. Y'all can see these here. This here just like takes up so much space to me. I could have a shelf and just really, you know, have it staggered up, but I can't. And seeing like when I do my shelf, it's, it, it just, I don't know. It's just in the way for me. <laughs> I don't like it. So I'm going to um take these shelves out of here is the um goal to take these shelves out. I think I might have told you I would like to knock this wall out and extend it, but I have this little situation going on here. But that's what I'm going to be doing is taking these wire shelves out. Um, yeah, I went through our little snack bins this morning. I've been trying to clean. That's what we have. Different stuff. Clean it out. So I'm just all over the place, you all. That's what I've been doing. Too much or nothing. I just wanted to jump on here and just say hello, good morning. You know, that whole nine. And when I decide to upload this video, y'all will see this. And I just, like I said, I hope you guys are just staying blessed. And the, uh, let me show y'all the actual mask. These are the ones I got for me. These are disposable. They FDA masks, okay? Blocking driplets. So it has all that 50 come in a pack. So I got me some of those too. Um, it's hard to find this stuff, y'all. So just order it and get it when you can. That's all I can say on that. But I did order some that supposed to be fashionably cute. So I can't wait for those to come in as well because that seemed like that's going to be our normal is wearing masks. Come this on. stuff is not going nowhere. So we just got to get used to it. So I'm going to put this stuff up. What I need to put up. And I'm going to take this out of here because it's all beat up. I was looking at it just seeing what it does. So, um, yeah. Since blocking triplets, that's what I wanted to do. Okay, so that's it. Um, yeah, that's pretty much that's all that's been going on with me. You are, um, yeah. that's it. I'm about to get my house situated and get it together. I guess I'm gonna put some clothes in the washer since nobody else done put clothes in the washer and I'm just gonna take my time at what I'm doing. But I'll uh, probably talk to you guys later. Okay, y'all. So this is what you're gonna end up with when you start taking the shells out. These huge, huge holes in your wall. Um, I just took out that side. This is giving me a little bit of a problem. Let me show y'all how I did that. So, what you're gonna need at first, I thought I would be able just to pull it out like this, but that's not working. So what you're gonna have to do is take a flathead screwdriver, and I'm trying to do this as well as hold the camera, and it's not letting me do it. Um, let me see here. Let me put y'all up on something. Here we go. So what you want to do is take a flathead screwdriver and stick it in there and work your way to pulling this screw, this nail out. And that one just, ooh, don't break the camera. And that's what you want to do. Then you can take the pliers if you choose to. Y'all, it's dirty down in here. And then pull it out like that. 
you don't have to. There you go. And this is the thing that's in there. And you love with those holes. So just in case someone was interested in trying to figure out how to take these wire shells out, that's how you do it. This part just easily pops up, but of course I have something on there that now to flop down, you can easily just pull that out and the others is the same. So I'm going to stop right here. I'm going to also sand those down, put some plaster in them and um, start sealing those up little by little because like I said I want to put shelving in here so I just wanted to share that with y'all real quick Down a brick road, click your heels and you'll be there.